all right all right guys welcome back to the channel today i am going to show you guys how to go live with the stream that you scheduled on youtube if you're using restream without creating a new stream on youtube right after the intro Now, for those of you who don't know what Restream.io is, it is a service and most of the time a free service that allows you to stream your content to multiple platforms at once via YouTube, Twitch, Facebook, Trovo, DLive, whatever you want. You can even do custom RTMPs in there. However, for the longest time, I ran into this issue, which was very strange to me, where I would schedule a stream on YouTube. And when I would go live in Restream, it would actually create a new live stream as opposed to connecting to the one that I already scheduled. I'm going to show you guys how to go ahead and rectify that issue very quickly. So the first thing you're going to want to do is open up YouTube Studio and you're going to want to schedule a stream as you usually do. Go to streaming software. I'm just going to reuse my settings and we'll just call this testing. Uh, I'm going to skip everything else because we're not really going live with this one. This is just going to be a dummy stream. So we'll say for tomorrow and God knows whatever time, 10 p.m. We'll make it unlisted so that it doesn't go get thrown out to my followers, my subscribers, and I don't want anyone thinking I'm going live and then I just don't. So we're going to go ahead and say done. Now that's it. We scheduled our stream. It's unlisted because for the intents and purposes of this video, I don't want it getting out there to the general public. Now we can actually get out of this now and we're going to launch OBS Studio. Now here, if you've already signed into Restream and you haven't, I'll show you how to do it. You go into settings, go into stream, the platform that you wish to stream to, which is going to be right here, Restream.io, and you're going to go ahead and connect the account. Now I'm not going to disconnect it. I'm not going to insult your intelligence. You guys obviously already know how to connect your accounts if you have one. If you haven't created one, go ahead and create one. After we've done that, we push OK. And if you push apply, all of these cool little windows are going to open. These things integrate seamlessly into Streamlabs OBS or OBS Studio. I do not recommend using Streamlabs OBS. It is a train wreck as of the last year, and I will never pay them money again. That's a whole nother debacle. So now what you guys want to do is you see here, I have my platform. I already have my YouTube channel connected. Before you go live, if I just say start streaming, what's going to end up happening is YouTube is going to create an entirely new stream. We don't want that. We want it to connect to the one that we've already scheduled. So what we do is we push the hamburger menu. We go to edit settings and you see here where it says create event. This is what the default is. So instead of creating an event, you see right here testing. That's the one that we just did. You're going to select that one. You guys can. It's still unlisted and the title and everything is the same. If you want to change anything else you forgot, that's fine. But I suggest putting as much detail in the original YouTube studio as you can so that all you have to do is go in here, select it and push save. Once it's finished saving, we're going to go ahead and when we start streaming, it will connect to the scheduled stream in YouTube as opposed to starting a brand new stream. I was actually running into this problem for months. I had no idea um, that this was actually a thing that you could do. It obviously was something that was already integrated into Restream, but I had no idea that for YouTube specifically, we actually had to go in and edit these settings and select the one that was already scheduled. So I really hope that this helped you guys, man. I was actually struggling with this. And the reason that I made it is because I was searching on forums for months and months why is this not working? And then finally, one quick little Reddit post showed, hey, this is how you do it, but I couldn't find any videos on it. So I hope that this helps anybody out there. Guys, remember that Jesus Christ is the only true way to God the Father. He is the truth, the way, and the life. And there is no other way to heaven except through him. Guys, be safe, be good, be blessed. I'll see you when I see you. Take care of each other. And remember that tomorrow isn't promised to anybody. Peace.